What happens to my pay if my delivery volume goes down? Great question, Jay. The simple answer is that you're going to make less money. How much less depends upon your ratio of fixed to variable pay. We explained previously that the contract is made up of fixed and variable components. Jay's contract leverages a higher fixed ratio, so more of his contract value is guaranteed. This will be advantageous if Jay's delivery volume falls. However, if his volume increases, he will not be able to capitalize fully on the extra volume. Let's dive into the contract to see how this works. As the description implies, the fixed component is the same regardless of volume. The main fixed component in an ISP's contract is known as the weekly service charge. You might think of this as the ISP's paycheck. Before becoming an ISP, Jay was in sales for a tech company. He was paid a base salary plus a commission. As an ISP, the weekly service charge functions like his base salary. Keep in mind that the weekly service charge is not a statement of charges to the ISP. Rather, it is a statement of charges to FedEx for services provided by the ISP. There are other fixed components that are not as significant contributors of revenue, such as vehicle and uniform brand promotion. These two payments compensate the ISP for ensuring employees and vehicles comply with FedEx branding. With these two components, Jay is paid a set weekly amount. However, the vehicle brand promotion is paid as a set amount per approved vehicle in use, so it is a bit of a hybrid. Typically speaking, the fixed components account for a total of 20 to 35% of the ISP's total pay. In Jay's case, his fixed pay represents a very high 35% of his contract value. This is because when Jay bought the business, the last contractor believed the volume was going to fall and negotiated a very high fixed weekly payment. For this reason, Jay is well positioned to handle a drop in volume. However, as soon as the volume rebounds, he will be at a disadvantage. So what does this all mean? Generally speaking, it is a good approach to maximize the fixed portion of the contract when you believe the economy is in a decline. Conversely, in a growing economy, Jay will realize more revenue with a higher variable ratio. Stay tuned for more on variable payments.